This tutorial will show you how to add and manage groups inside of My Courses. There are two ways to get to groups. You can either get to it by going to the Communication tab and selecting Groups, or by going to Edit Course and selecting Groups. Both those options will take you to the same place. I'm going to create a new category. I'm going to title this category Accommodations. I could add a description if I wanted to, but for now I'm just going to leave that blank. For the enrollment type for this one, I'm going to leave it as numbers of groups because I know that I want two groups, one for time and a half and one for double time. But there are other options here. If I knew the numbers of students that I wanted in each group, I could select this one and then those options, I could also allow them to have groups of numbers or numbers of groups and allow students to self-enroll into those groups if for some reason I had an activity that corresponded with that. I'm going to create two groups here. There are additional options down here that if I was creating these groups I could also create discussion area and Dropbox folder just for those groups. I'm not doing that for this example so I'm just going to hit save. Once back in here now you see that I have one category called accommodations and I have two groups. I'm going to change the names of these groups. To change the name, I click on Group 1, and in here I'm going to put Time and a Half. I'm going to hit Save. Now I'm going to come back to Group 2, and I'm going to put Double Time. And hit Save. Now I have two groups under the category of Accommodations. One titled Double Time, the other one titled Time and a Half you can see I currently have no members on either one of these groups. To add members to this team I'm going to go back into Double Time and I'm going to select Enroll Users. From here I have my class list and I'm going to select Demo Faculty 2 and Demo Faculty 3 and hit Save. And now you can see I have two users on this team. Time and a half, I'm going to come back in here and select Enroll Users, and I'm going to add Demo Faculty. So now you see I've created a category for accommodations. I've created two teams in those accommodation category, Double Time and Time and a half, and I have two users enrolled on Double Time and one user enrolled in Time and a half. If I wanted to, I could delete, I could delete this entire category where I could delete the individual groups in these categories. And that is a quick tutorial on how to add and manage groups inside of my courses.